And if you're producing, you can't be on the call. What would that do to us? And so we got to be able to understand what we have. So here's the pruning process. After Lot had gone, the Lord said to Abram, look as far as you can see. Now understand that in the season, you're going to have to travel light. You're going to have to travel light. There's some things you can't bring with you in 22. <laughs> some people you can't bring with you. Some habits you can't bring with you. And so we said to Abram, look as far as you can see. And I think this right here was very, very important because there's the action word. There's that verb, look. In season, I'm sensing that God is saying to us, I want you to come up higher. Even in I am, I want you to come up higher. You know, for, for, for some who have decided, you know what? I'm not going to leave any money on the table. I'm going to profit share with this company. $150 for a child of the king. Is that enough? $150 for a child of the king. Is that enough? When you have access to a million dollars a month in the space. Guys, I profit share with the company and every Friday, I'm grateful and I'm thankful, Auntie. But I know, knowing the Christopher Terry that we know, knowing the Mama Isis that we know, knowing the fact that he wants us and they want us guys to be able to be financially independent and free so we could finance our vision. It bothers me because I said, you know, on today, I'm getting X, Y, Z, and then there's still millions on the table, auntie, every Friday. And so look as far as your eyes can see in every direction, come up higher, desire more, north, south, east, and west. He said, I'm giving you all this land as far as what? As far as your eyes can see. Going back now to that beautiful um, um, uh, eagle, and one of the things with the eagle is that they have excellent long distance vision. They can see clearly about eight times as far as humans can. And so what we're doing right now in the season is asking God to see, asking God to open our eyes, asking guys to see why we're here at I Am Academy and what is it that he has for us. I know there's more. But God, I'm asking you to open my spiritual eyes. I'm tired of seeing what I can see with my natural eyes. And he said to Abram, he said, as far as your eyes can see, how far can you see, guys? How far can you see? And so the thing about the eagle, going back to the eagle, uh, the, his, the vision, they can see clearly eight times as far as humans can, allowing them to spot and focus a rabbit or another animal at a distance of two miles. So we may just be able to see the, circum the circumference of the room that we're in, but understand that an eagle can see two miles. What would happen then if you ask God to give you the vision of an eagle, to give you the eyesight of an eagle? My gosh, so that we're no longer just seeing things that are near us, but we're seeing things from afar. And so we got to be able to understand that if you ask him, if you ask him, he'll give it to you. And he said, I'm giving you all this land as far as you can see to you and your descendants as a permanent possession. He said, and I will give you so many descendants like the dust of the earth. They cannot be counted. So he's saying to you, go walk through the land. What are you believing God for this year? How big is your why? He said, go walk through the land in every direction. He says, for I am giving it to you. You know, one thing about vision that is so key is that when you recognize, first of all, vision was given to God from us to be able to give us a permanent address. Somebody type that in the chat. Vision was entrusted to us by God so we can have permanent address. Vision will help you to choose your friends. Come on now. A person who has vision is very single-minded, very focused, because they know what their goal, what, what, where, where they're going. Yesterday for our leader team call with Auntie Jay, her focus was on goals. And one of the things we learned about is the fact of being focused. And so vision will help you to remain focused. Vision will help you to choose your friends. 
Vision will help you to choose your priorities. When you have vision, you could say no. No is an anointed word. That's not for me. Somebody brings something to you. You know, I mean, the, 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 the chair that I'm sitting in here at the Kingdom Chamber of Commerce, I represent uh, uh, so many small business owners, right? Business owners. And, and the thing about it is everything that, that lands on planet Earth, chances are somebody wants me to participate in it. But had I say yes to everything, I would be selling, no offense, Mary Kay, I would be selling Amway, I would be selling, uh, uh, you name it, garments, everything under the sun. I would be as a peddler. So nobody would even find me as a, as a, as a person that they could even... Uh, 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 want to be in business with because every time they turn around, I'd be doing something else. So we got to be able to understand that what vision will do to you is to be able to give you priorities, allow you to say no, because you know what you're focusing on. Vision will allow you to, to choose your, 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 your diet because you won't be able to eat anything if you know where you're going. And I think our leader is a perfect example of that with Dr. Jewel. Right. Vision is going to even affect the attitude in your life. Right. You're going to have a certain attitude because you know where you're going. You know, vision will also help you with your lifestyle because you know what lifestyle you need to have in terms of where you're going. Uh, vision will, will even your values is affected by your vision. Why? Because it's going to dictate how you behave and the standards by which you should live by. Guys, a person with vision is very disciplined. You know, Dr. Jewel never have to call me to say, Angela, don't forget to get on the call. Auntie don't have to call and say, don't forget to get on the call. Guys, when you have vision, when you, it, it, it creates barriers for you. It keeps you focused. It draws you to something. No one ever have to send you a reminder when you're operating with vision. Why? Because you know where you're going and you know what you do to get there. And you're not constantly getting on and getting off exits. You're focused. You're going straight. You know where you're going. And so understand that, 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 that vision will clarify your purpose. Why are you here? When you have that vision, having events know that you have to be there. We don't ever have to go. And I'm telling you, the day's going to come that the moment an event comes out, it's sold out. Why? Because we're people that are operating with such great vision. And we know the importance of it, which means then the team members that we have, Auntie, will also be focusing at that level as well. Now, vision creates resources. Vision will attract your, your resources. Many of us are here because we have big vision. And so if you have big vision, why not partner with Christopher Terry, learn the skill set, get the millions that he's basically giving to us. Like right now, there's another thousand dollars on the table. We'll talk about that in a little bit. Every time you turn around here, guys, there's money. And for some of you, the vision that you have of maybe starting your nonprofit, having your foundation, uh, whatever it is that God has called for you to do, the money is right here. And so we got to be able to understand it, you know, and, 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 uh, <laughs> you know, it's, it's very, very important that we understand that God has called you to be distinguished. There are some vitamins that you're going to need on this walk, right? And it, when I say vitamin D, you're going to need this to win. What are you talking about, Angela? Idea of discipline. And guys, that's what vision will do. Vision helps you to be so disciplined. Discipline with your calendar. Discipline with your to everything. Because not everything that's good for me is beneficial for me. But I know that the things that God has called me to, I have to focus on it. And so that vitamin D, thank you, Nina. That vitamin D is so, so, so important for us. The discipline. Guys, look, a, 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 a disciplined person, when you find somebody uh, uh, who, is, who is disciplined, you don't have to keep telling them something every minute. They, they, they have a way of how they govern themselves. They understand that in the space, for me to be able to win, for me to be able to I'm sorry. If somebody would be. Okay, we did that. All right. If somebody made me the host, Angela, I'll help you uh, mute it out. Oh, Dr. K is on. Did you come on now. All righty, Dr. K, co-host, come on now. 
That's that. Oh my God. Dr. K has changed my life, guys. I love me some Dr. K. When I first got into the space, I met Dr. K actually before, uh, um, I met Dr. K very early on, just coming in the space and I actually met her via YouTube. And I saw this woman actually talking about Ecclesiastics 11, 11 and 1, and uh, that it's good to enter into foreign trade. And, 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 and that for me was like a key, because for me, the way I govern my life, if the word of God says it, I'm going to do it. If the word of God says I can have it, I'm going to have it. And so I was in the, she was giving her testimony and that Saturday, and I'll never forget how I just ran around that gym, guys, because I felt like this is it. This is it, God. This is you telling me I have to trade. I have to enter into the market. So ECC 11 is big for me. Love you, love you, love you, Dr. K. So guys, back to back to our vitamin D, right? Vitamin D is discipline. So as leaders with a vision, uh, uh, discipline is such an integral part of our walk. And when you have discipline, even as a leader in the space, how does that affect everything? What does that look like? Well, it looks like your calendar. If I was to look at your calendar right now, it wouldn't look blank. It would have activities on there, right? So, so, so important. You know, how many calls are you doing every day, Demetrius? Who are you showing this business to? Auntie is very big on that. She was like, presentation, presentation, presentation. She talks to her leaders. I speak to my leaders, so key. Uh, what we did last year was to have uh, uh, all of the leaders in the team basically start having their own presentations. And, and as a leader, we got to be able to also understand that not everybody is comfortable doing a presentation. So you just can't expect that people will get up there and just push, but you got to be able to help them and guide them. And so in a safe space, we, we actually created an environment where each leader had a presentation that they were hosting on a given day. So all seven days we had presentation in our team. Guys, that was so effective because now, they, and we did everything for them. We did the flyer for them. We did the promotion for them. What was that doing? Helping them. See, the thing about leadership, I do, you watch, you do, I watch, you're released. I do, you watch, you do, I watch, and then you're released. And so we got to be able to help people where they are. So back to vitamin D, being very disciplined, being motivated, being able to make sure, guys, that nobody needs to tell you what to do. The night before, as a matter of fact, today, what I'd like for you to do is keep track of everything that you do from the moment you wake up until you go to sleep. And then you're going to analyze your schedule and look and see where am I putting the most of my time? If I'm talking about becoming a chairman in this organization, are my activities driving me towards that? If somebody was to look at my schedule, can they see how focused I am? How many people am I talking to? Am I getting my, 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 my leads, my contacts? Am I getting them in a presentation? Am I having those calls with them? Am I connecting them to my, my, my chairman or my uh, team leaders for three ways? You know, how, where am I with my closing ratio? Discipline is very, very key. Next vitamin we need, vitamin C. Can anybody tell me what vitamin C is? Put in the chat, vitamin C. What would you think vitamin C is? Vitamin C, what would you, what would you say is vitamin C? Consistency, correct. Consistency, yes, 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 yes. So we're going to have to make sure, guys, that we have vitamin C also as a part of the equation because we got to be able to make sure we're consistent. We could also say for vitamin C, so consistency has nothing to do with how you feel. Guys, I, I was thinking about this recently and I said maybe there are about 85% of the things I do that I don't feel like doing it. Talk to me, somebody. Talk to me, somebody. There's some things that I do, a lot of what I do, that I don't feel like doing it. But what does feelings have to do with it? Guys, you can't feel and change lives. <laughs> you got to die to your feelings. You got to die to self. You know, so you got to be able to. <laughs> That's it, Dr. Samantha. The flesh is a mess. You can't trust it. Because if, if, I mean, if you go by what you feel, you could be eating things we got no business eating. Like right now, I'm on this clear. I mean, as a matter of fact, right here, see, I keep my blend jet with me. And, and what's in my blend jet? What I love about, look at that. Look at that. Look at that, guys. Blender. What's in here? All my supplements, all my good stuff, my vitamin D, my C. I got iron in here. 
I got my liquid vitamin in here. Guys, I pour it all in. I got B12 in here. So if I'm going to take it, let me just take it and get it over with, right? And so you got to be able to understand, you know, the importance of it. It's not about how I feel, but it's what I know is good for me. Because if you follow your feeling, you'll do stuff that you have absolutely no business doing. You'll just lay in a couch all day. And then before you know it, the sun's up and the sun is down. Another, another C uh, in, in the vitamin C's is confidence. Is confidence for you to be able to understand that, that people could read you. You know, it's like a monitor that's on your shoulder. And so people can see whether or not uh, uh, 40 years of running this month, many days not feeling like it. That's it, right, Wanda? Four miles right now. It's good for you. You see what I'm saying? To God be the Lord. It's like starting off the year and fasting. Do you think I want to (laughs) fast? You know, who wants to give up that fried chicken? Who wants to give up that bread? Who wants to give up that rice? You see what I'm saying, Demetrius? But then you understand that it's actually bigger than me. And you understand that you have to take this flesh and you got to put the flesh under subjection and you got to tell the flesh, you're not having that. No, 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 no. You're not having that. Why? Because I need clarity as I go through my year. And so guys, back to the vitamin C is confidence. Being able to understand guys, the the confidence that you have. uh, uh, And this is why every time we get on call and we're getting different uh, uh, hearing uh, uh, from different leaders uh, and hearing from our, our chairman, uh, 100 on here as well, Chairman 250 loading, Dr. Jewel, and, and being able to now understand that, guys, that, that that I have confidence. You know, the more I start doing things with my team, the more I step out, maybe I decide, Nina, that I'm going to now take advantage of what this academy has for me fully, and I'm going to go all in. See, this year, you're going to have to decide that I'm going all in. At the beginning of every year, I always wonder, even with the chamber, as we're starting the year together, who will finish the year with me? I'm sure Dr. Jewel had that thought as well. Of all the leaders on here, Dr. K, who's going to finish with us come December 31st? We said Happy New Year together, but who's going to close out the year with us? And so, guys, confidence is going to allow you guys, even if you're not, I think Lady J said this last night, you're just pushing, you're just starting. You're not trying to figure everything out. And especially those of us that have Christ on the inside of us, are you kidding me? All he wants you to do is open your mouth. And when you open your mouth, that confidence is going to start building. When you know who you are, confidence will build. When you're surrounded with people who are walking with vision, who are walking with their understanding as to who they are, it will help you to be able to build your confidence. Sometimes we got to borrow from them. When you do your presentation, right? Remember, it may not happen on day one, but like we did with our team, every day a different team member was doing a presentation. What happens after a while? They'd be getting on there and they're so relaxed and, and you know, they're doing their thing. And then before you know it, folks are coming in. It's called confidence. So key. Now let's, let's keep moving forward. Let's keep moving forward. Another vitamin is vitamin A. What do you think is vitamin A? Type it in the chat. What would you say is vitamin A? Vitamin A, anyone? Vitamin A. Vitamin A. Vitamin A. Vitamin A is leader. Hey, Brandon, come on now. Accountability. Yes, Dr. Samantha, taking action. And so we got to be able to make sure that in this space, attitude. Very, very good. Alignment. Ooh, my favorite word. Alicia, attitude. Come on, that's right. You know, and as leaders, these are very key vitamins. These are very key that we understand that in the vitamin A's, you have your you have your attitude, you have your action, you had you have your affirmation that you're doing every day. You know, your attitude has to be right. Guys, as leaders, we got to be able to understand that people are watching us, but more so the accountability, accountability that starts with yourself first. And the question is, do you believe that God has called you to be great? Because I could tell you all of this, but if you don't believe in it, you can't see yourself. You know, when, a, when a, well, I have a picture that I use in some of my presentation of a cat actually looking at a lion. And when the cat looks at the lion, the cat sees himself as a lion. When the mirror, there's a cat and he sees himself. Who do you see yourself as? Do you believe that there's grace on the inside of you? Do you believe that you can hit rank? And so as we go through this first quarter, it's going to be so important that you understand uh, the importance of you now, the, the, the importance of you setting those goals for yourself, seeing yourself, and then break it down. Start off with today. I'm going to challenge you today. 
to introduce the academy to 12 people. Write down 12 people. And I want you to introduce the academy to them. And I don't want you to try to make it complicated. Sometimes we talk too much and we don't deliver. But I know that this is a season where we're not only talking, guys, but we're actually delivering in the season. We want to see deliverables. <laughs> and that's where even that accountability comes in. Accountable, accountable to your chairman, accountable to your team leader. So, 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 so important, right? I want somebody, if you have the, uh, I'm also going to need the flyer for Arkansas because that's coming up as well. And pretty soon, guys, we won't even have to do a whole lot to be able to. No volume. Angela, can you unmute? Unmute. Yep, thank you. Somebody unmuted me. Okay, yesterday for our CEO, our CEO call yesterday, Christopher Terry, how many of you were on there? If you were on the CEO, on, on the Christopher Terry yesterday and Jason, guys, go ahead again and type a nine in the chat. Let me just see something real quickly. A nine in the chat. A nine in the chat. A nine in the chat. See, that's what discipline will do. Discipline will keep you connected. Unmute yourself. Miss Angela, unmute yourself. Okay, good. Or how about now? You're good. Okay, good. All right, good. We can hear you. Okay, wonderful. So so yesterday, so so when when our when 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 our CEO has an opportunity to speak, guys, you want to be able to make sure that you're on there. You never, never, ever, ever want to miss what the visionary has to say. God has put the vision on the inside of Christopher Terry for each and every one of us. So I don't care where I am, what I'm doing. When my chairman leader, Dr. Jewel, is on, I, I find a way to be on, no matter which part of the world I am. You know, when, when, when Auntie's on, I make sure I hardly ever. Auntie Jay, you're on here. Get off mute, Auntie. How many of your leadership team calls have I missed? <laughs> Zero. <laughs> It don't matter where I, I mean, am. Guys. It doesn't matter where you are. You can be feeding the flamingos. You're going to find a way to get on. That is an absolute positive. Yes. <laughs> you see what I'm saying? So when, when, when our chairman, Christopher Terry, comes on, you drop what you're doing and you're on there to be able to, one, show him honor, two, being able to make sure you're aligned with where the company is going. You want to be able to make sure that your provision for the vision, you want to be able to make sure you're hearing what God has placed in his heart and how it's going to affect you, your organization, and your family. Yesterday calls was powerful. I'm not sure if they recorded it, but if it did, please go ahead and find the recording. And in 2022, there won't be, they won't be that many recordings. Oh, I can't be on. Can you record it? Can I get the recording? No, you're going to need to be able to make sure as much as you can have somebody have a recorder on for you or you record it. I've done that sometimes. Can't necessarily be focused on the call. I'll turn my recorder on and I'll go back. Guys, what is that called? Discipline. Why? Because I have vision. And that's a key part of leadership. So there was a special yesterday that was actually announced, the Double Rush promo. Now, many of us know a couple months ago, about a month and a half ago, right after we came out of convention, we had the Double Rush promo, right? And I'm telling Auntie that for me, I think I was 10 was the max to get 500, right? I signed up nine. So I got paid for eight. And I'm telling you, $185 was a sweet spot for so many people. And I'm telling you, my team, we're meeting tonight, and I'm pushing every one of my team members now to be able to get $1,000 that's sitting on the table. So what's going to happen when we do this? We're going to become intentional. We're going to be disciplined about sharing this opportunity. Guys, there's so many people that have exited. The green exodus has taken place from the workplace. A lot of people, you're no longer going to get them to come and sit down and put their feet under your desk. And you have to be able to keep checking in on them. What have you done? That, that, that ain't happening no more. That ain't happening no more, right? A lot of folks have now recognized one thing, that what 19 did, it showed people that I can have freedom and that I can have flexibility. And so where are these people right now? They're looking for new opportunities. Who's holding on to the opportunities, Auntie? We are. You are. 
There are 12 people around you right now that needs to know about this, this academy. Why? Because you may have the next Dr. Kathy Kirkland on your team. You may have the next Auntie Jay on your team. You may have the next Dr. Jewel on your team. You may have the next Dr. China right in your circle. And so what Christopher Terry is saying that I will partner with you. And he said, I'm going for every person that you bring in, every two customers that you bring in. Well, first of all, what he's saying is it's gonna be a win-win. It's not gonna be a win just for us. I always believe in an exchange. New customers are gonna get $50 off when they join. When they join, they get $50 off. So if you, I want you to go back over your list and I want you to identify those people who are crying money. So you got to be able to pin people when they say, well, you know, well, I'm not ready now. Why are you not ready? Well, I'm not ready because, you know, I just can't come up with that. I'll write that in my notes so that when I go back in this book here, they're in here. When I go back to my list, I'll realize that money was an issue for that person. So now let's go back to them. $50 right now when they join, when they get $50 off the FRX, off the HFX, DCX, or ECX, right? 50, they, they're only paying $185, all righty? And now what do you get as an IBO? Now, this is important because if you're fairly new and you're like, Angela, what is an IBO? I want to be able to get a $100 bonus for every two people that I sign up. Well, it means you need to become an independent business owner with this company. What does that mean, Angela? It means that you're open for business. It means that you're actually starting a franchise. Christopher Terry is saying, I'll give you your own, your, your own franchise for $16.71. Somebody correct me if I'm wrong. Where do you go and have access to be able to have a system that's already built for you, done for you system? All you have to do is what? Just, just follow the plan. Everything is there for you. You don't really have to go create anything. Any, everything is already created. You're not the one teaching. I call this position a glorified receptionist position. All I'm doing is sitting at the switchboard and making the connection. I'm identifying people that needs to be identified with this opportunity, getting them in front of the rights. And then when they come to the academy, connecting them with the educators. We thank God for our educators, guys. Their job, they work for us. <laughs> I love it. They work for us. All you got to do is bring the people. And so you as an IBO, remember, don't just go sign up for IBO without talking to your team leader because we need to be able to make sure you're ready. We don't need another IBO that would just take up space. We need an IBO that's ready to bring production. Guys, God is holding us to produce. You were created here on planet Earth to produce. He said, be fruitful. What does that mean? Production. He said, multiply. I'm going to give you the secret to franchising. He said, be fruitful. Production. Multiply. Take that one thing and take it into different cities. Start creating teams in different cities. We'll have the ability to do that with the next event that's coming up in Arkansas. Come on now. We have the ability now to subdue. So here you have the ability, guys, to grow. We don't need another IBO. You're going to get $100 when you sign up two customers. Now, you must have a minimum of 150 PV. Now, we know that's a no-brainer for any of us because we are products of the product right? That's how you're able to share this opportunity. Why would you share something that you're not participating in? Why would you share something that you don't even have a package for? And so qualifying IBO must maintain their IBO status till receipt of payment to be eligible. This can be repeated up to what? 10 times, Nina. So if there's anyone on this call that has cried out to God just this morning. And you have said that I have bills and I need money. Don't you ever ask God for another cent. Don't ask God for no more money because the thing about God, he gives you ideas. <laughs> he gives you opportunity, Dr. Samantha. He gives you opportunity. And so now with that opportunity, Pastor Tony says, please clarify, a person has to be an IBO for first. Correct, Dr. Tony. Uh, Pastor Tony, correct. Correct. 
So you have to become an IBO first. And so, you know, how do you become an IBO? Well, first of all, because you've been blessed with this God's gift for 2022. Amen. With this, with this gift that you have been given to, I call I Am Academy a gift that has been given to us or entrusted to us. So as you've been blessed, you start sharing it with others. Guys, this is the only place. I'm in ministry. And so we're always sharing, always giving. But was it a sweet and what a blessing, Auntie, to know that now when I share, I get rewarded for sharing, manifested in cash. Come on now, girl, love her some coins. Hey. And so when you start sharing, (laughs) when you start sharing this opportunity, you get rewarded for it. But the greatest reward is not just the money. The greatest reward is to see lives being transformed as our lives are being transformed. That part for me, to be able to know that you're making a difference in the life of a family, to be able to help people to understand. Many of us grew up in families where we were never taught about money. Guys, when I saw money growing up, I saw money in my grandfather's Bible and that Bible was closed. Not the best place for money to learn about money, guys. That that was not healthy at all. So, So you're in a position now where we have the ability to be able to help others. And there are people right now that have been praying for an opportunity. There are folks right now that may be in corporate positions right now, may own businesses right now, Every just about every partner in the Kingdom Chamber of Commerce. I can't force them to be a part of, uh, uh, of the academy. And those of you that are chamber partners that are on here, go ahead and, and put a fire emoji or a nine in the chat. But I do tell them that you could be your own bank being in this space. One of the biggest challenge that we find is that you know a lot of folks will abort their vision as a result of money. You go to the bank, you create a business plan, you pour your heart out only for them to turn around and to say to you, I'm sorry, but it's not viable. Oh, I'm sorry, Nina, let me see you put your fire emoji in the chat. Come on, Wanda, let's go. Quite a few of you are on here. If you're a chamber partner, member of the Kingdom Chamber of Commerce, partner of, go ahead and put a fire emoji in the chat. Because guys, I encourage business people entrepreneurs to be able to make sure that they understand how to trade foreign currency, how to, to what ECC 11 really means to their future, and to be able to make sure they come in, be a part of the FRX, HFX, DCX, ECX, to be able to make sure now that you are now responsible for you when it comes to funding your vision, when it comes to cash flow. So I want to encourage you. It's time for you to get out the boat. You've been comfortable for too long. I want you to be able to make yourself uncomfortable. I want you to start reaching out to people that you know you need to reach out to, but you just don't know how to have the conversation. And I want you to just make it as simple for them as possible. And just basically say to them, because I care for you. Guys, people don't care how much you know until they know how much you care. Because I care for you. And I believe in your vision. I need to connect you with a platform that will be able to help you to be able to fund your vision. Oh, is it the bank? No, it's not the bank. (laughs) We're gonna give you the strategy to be your own bank and get them in front of a presentation, guys. Their lives will be transformed. I listened to a presentation that said, be comfortable being uncomfortable, and that's it. Auntie said, don't abort your vision today due to money. That's it, because it's not about the money. It's about what you're able to see. Come by without money. The Bible tells you that. Guys, if you could find money to pay your Sprint phone bill or your Verizon, and you have a phone that doesn't bring you back no money, you could pay $185. Start looking around your closet, as Dr. K would say. Bake a cake. Make some cupcakes. Do whatever you got to do. Sell some wares. You got clothes. You got a lot of stuff going on. You got to lighten the load to be able to make sure we're focused on our investment so we can live off the interest. So again, guys, this uh, 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 promo has started. It started yesterday and it's running on to March the 5th. Even though the flyer says February 5th, it's running on to March the 5th. And we want you and we want your team. Guys, how many of you could use an extra $1,000? Go ahead and type it in the chat. 
How many of you can use an extra thousand dollars? Type it in the chat. An extra thousand dollars. <laughs> an extra thousand dollars. What would that mean for your family? Let me tell you something. How big is your why? My why is big. I got a daughter in my husband and I. We have a daughter in medical school. That ain't cheap, auntie. That will keep your why big. And then we have a son in college studying aeronautical engineering, you know, looking to go for his pilot license soon. That ain't cheap. I told my kids, you guys, when you were younger, you were a lot more, I mean, it was like easy. But now that you're grown, it's like thousands. Every time we turn around, it's thousands. <laughs> And so Wanda says she's ready for her extra hundred. Montree says, I'm always accepting an extra thousand. Wanda said 1,000. <laughs> I am, uh, Lady Bird Talker said extra 1,000. Uh, 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 Kay Johnson said 1,000. Come on, guys, go ahead. If you're believing that you could, it's not even a whole lot to believe, but if you just want an extra thousand dollars and you're willing to do the work, Andre, come on, Andre. He said an extra 1,000. Demetrius said 1,000. Jasmine said 1,000. Come on now, Carl. Hey, Pastor Carl, 1,000. Come on now. And it's just extra. We don't want you to focus on the 1,000. It's just extra. But the thing about it, because it has been dropped in your presence, I want you to pick it up. And so, guys, we want to talk also as we get ready to wrap up in a bit. We want you to also remember, uh, the anybody has that flyer, Auntie? The date, Auntie, can you get off? Can you take off, uh, come off mute and talk about the upcoming event? Because we grow from events to events. Yes, we do. We grow from events to Oh, Dr. Angela, you've been slamming this call. Oh, my God. And we got these numbers up to put some sevens in the chat for Dr. Angela. She is bringing it all the way in right now. I mean, you are speaking to us and you're speaking to my Shanana right now. But guys, yes, in regard to the next upcoming event, it is in um uh, Little Rock, Arkansas. And I did send you the flyer, Dr. Angela, but it's in Little Rock, Arkansas. It's just a one-day event. And it is January the 22nd. We're super, super excited about it. And you had to be somewhere up underneath a rock and not in Little Rock if you haven't heard about what's going on. And it's actually coming up in, what, about a week and a half or something like that. So if you don't have your tickets, get your tickets now and just be prepared and come to the event. You know, precautions, we're going to make sure that we're making all the necessary Necessary precautions because that's just a, our way of life right now. Wherever we go, we have to be precautionary. We have to use those precautionary measures and just trust and step out on faith and just get there, be there. So I'm looking to see you there. Auntie Jay going to be there. Auntie Jay going to be there. I want y'all to be there. So January the 22nd in Little Rock, Arkansas. Events are so important. You do not want to miss. Curtis Cobain is going to be in the house and you know he's going to be dropping it. He's going to be dropping it and a lot of other good surprises. So be there. That's it. If you got your ticket, I see Ruth from my team. Come on, Ruth, representing New Jersey. Ruth said, I got my ticket. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Who else got their ticket? Come on now. Who else got their ticket? Go ahead and type that you got your ticket in the chat. Come on now, VIP Aaron. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Come on now. Felicia said, got mine. Pastor Sherry said, I do. Montre said, I got my ticket. Um, uh, Bayana said, VIP, come on now, Joe Green, I got my ticket. Yvette, I got my ticket. Come on, Demetrius, VIP. Guys, that's how you're going to travel. It's time for an upgrade. It's time for an upgrade. 2022, we're upgrading. I'm telling you, in every area of our lives. Also, our chairman wanted me to remind everyone uh, that Monday tonight at 8 p.m. Uh, Eastern, what is it, 8 p.m. Central Time, 9 p.m. Eastern, right? Okay, so 9 p.m. Eastern, not 8. 9 p.m. Eastern, guys, tonight, first quarter push, right? We're going to be trading together as a group. Dr. Kathy, you're going to be on there, Dr. K. I want you to get off mute if you can, Dr. K, please, and talk to us. Tell us what to expect tonight because we're, we're excited. Want to get all your teams reactivated as soon as possible. Go ahead and go into your back office. I had mine up to show you, but for the sake of time, I want you to go in and schedule time today. Give yourself at least one hour, guys. Give yourself 60 minutes today. Just carve out 60 minutes to go back in your back office, right? And to be able to activate your folks. These people are waiting for you to call them. Your team members, those that have left for whatever reason. January is here now. Now people are looking. Guys, they're coming in. They're coming in like, like sand on the seashore. We won't be able to count them. 
1 million families we're going to be impacting here through IM Academy. So you want to get your teams reactivated. You're going to have to be active in order to trade. Dr. K? Hey, yes, I'm here. Listen, tonight, uh, Angela did a powerful call this morning. Uh, Y'all, I mean, you you just can't lose with the leadership that we have in this group. But listen, on tonight, Lee Lee Allen and Dr. Ben Tankert, maybe because it's his birthday, but Lee Allen, myself, and Dr. Ben, we're going to get on here. We're going to ensure that, you know, we're going to try to help you analyze the charts a lot better than what you've been doing and to show you what's moving in the market. I will be doing ECC 11 2.0 and, you know, and our wicks are money and the money line. Uh, Lee Allen will be using her pivots and Dr. Ben, binary Ben, got his own strategy. And, uh, and what we're doing is we're all coming together as one to where we all are winning at the same time. I don't know if y'all remember how we used to do 10 pips and dip. We get our 10 pips and we were out of the market. And we did a lot during that time. It, it brought unity, brought strength. And the, the blessing uh, that you guys have is, you know, some of us, some of you could be future educators. Who knows? Because when Lee and I started, we all, Dr. Jewel was the first IML TV. I'm going to say that. She was the first IML TV. And then that's when all the other educators start coming along and Chris Terry start revamping everything. We were getting on once uh, a night. Uh, we, I think Lee had Tuesdays. I had Thursdays. I showed you how to compound, how to calculate pips, all of that. And we're going to get on here tonight. Now, we're leaving that part up to you for your new members and your team. And, uh, and we're going to get on here tonight and tomorrow, and we're going to analyze charts. We're going to reach goals. We can't give you a goal, and we're not doing a challenge. You can challenge yourself, and you can set out your goal for what you want to do and what you want to create, and we're going to be here and pick it up. And I see Aaron is here. Aaron is the one that snatched the wig off of US 30 every time, every morning when we get on. <laughs> and, sometimes, and we double up and we roll over. We don't lose. We We learn and we double up and we roll over and we keep it moving. So, guys, I'm excited about tonight. So, I look forward to seeing you there. Angela, I'm going to turn it back over to you. Hey, (laughs) TT. Hey, Dr. K. Love you. (laughs) Mm, mm, mm. That's awesome, guys. So, we look forward to, again, let's go ahead and get these folks reactivated. I want you to think about this real quickly. And... um, The fact that you decided to partner and even profit share with this company, your life's about to take an amazing turn. But I want you to think about this. In the space, momentarily or monetarily, you can have more than you can spend in this space. Auntie, you heard that? Imagine having having more than you can spend. (laughs) <laughs> just the interest and the dividends coming passively from your investments are more than you ever made working full-time in your past. Your income flows from the efforts, not only of you, but also from the efforts of your team and from a huge customer base that you have built over the years. I want you to dream with me now. You're now living a lifestyle where you no longer have to look at the price when you're reading the menus while dining out. (laughs) Dream with me now. You could take an exotic vacation every three months. Come on now to a new place, something new and something exciting. Dream with me now. You can walk new beaches around the world on weekdays when others are stuck in office buildings back home. Why? Because what we have been granted with and trusted, you can do this business from anywhere. Speaking of your home, dream with me now. You can have multiple homes (laughs) in different locales and decked with lavish decor that you spent time (laughs) handpicking every piece that goes into your home. Your family, dream with me now, enjoys the different homes and each feels so homey. You have true freedom, time freedom, and you set your own schedule, come on now, to satisfy your every whim. You take mission trips 
You give your time to charitable causes that makes your heart beat and bring tears to your eyes. You're able to help those that needs help. Mm, 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 mm. Somebody placed in the chat earlier, and this stimulated this for me to share this. They said they paid so much money on funerals right now that they could use another thousand dollars. I can't remember who that person is. If you could type your name in the chat, but being able guys to know when somebody has a need, that for me right there is what touches my heart that I can now come in and I can say, don't worry about it. I got that. You know what that means? Being able to give your church church more money than you made in a year from your job. Guys, this is what the space will do for you. You have been put in a place of legacy that will survive you, that will be enjoyed and empowered many generations after you. The respect of the admiration you receive from your family and friends make you feel so proud yet humble. And all the worldly things have had an inverse effect on you. The trappings of your success were pride invoking along the way. But now that you're on the other side of money, this is what I Am Academy will do, Auntie. It puts us on the other side of money. Now you have trust fund babies, right, Dr. K? To God be the glory. You're on the other side of money. You're on the other side of success. And you give the credit upward and understand to whom you belong. Guys, that's called vision. And this is what this space has afforded you. So I pray that you were blessed by today's session. I want to give an opportunity uh, to any of the chairmen that's on here. Guys, if you want to connect with me, this is a way to be able to stay connected. Uh, but I want to give an opportunity to any of the chairmen that may want to say something as we close out. I know we ran a little bit over, uh, and I know that you'll be back on again later tonight, and I know you have those calls to be able to make you accountable. We'll get them in. Any chairman would like to share anything about, you know, you have the floor. Well, you know, I'm here, Dr. Angela. I don't know who else is on, you know, um, powerful call, absolutely powerful call. You know, I've been excited to just get on with you because I know you always bring the goose. You always bring the juice. You always bring the sauce, the secret sauce. So powerful, powerful call. I thank you. I'm, look, I got my notes, you know, you know, I got my pages and everything of notes okay. and, you know, let's just go guys. Let's just go. You know, this is our time. This is our season. It's a new year. It's a new year. It's a new you. So let's just go and make it happen. I'm excited. Let's it. Let's get it. Yeah. Thank you, Auntie. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Alrighty, guys. So we're going to uh, say uh, we're going to bless you this day. And we decree and declare right now in the name of Jesus that you can do it. Just do it like Nike. Was it? What was Nike? Just do it. Just do it. <laughs> just do it. Stop sitting down and trying to figure things out in the season. Just do it. What are you going to do? Find somebody to hold yourself accountable to. Find somebody right now on your team and say, I want you to hold me accountable to my going back in my own back office, making time every day to be able to start off with my back office, work on those reactivations, introduce this platform to folks that I know, coming up with my 12 people that I know I need to talk to that I've not had an opportunity to, to, to share it with for whatever reason. Maybe I was nervous. Maybe I didn't think they needed Guys, it's the people that you think don't need this really needs us. And so I want to say God bless you guys. I keep our chairman leader always lifted up in prayer. Dr. J, let's get her to 250, guys. We can do this. She should be a chairman, 1 million, and we're working towards that. I love you guys. I thank God for you. Have yourself a blessed day, and let's go change lives. You know, remember, you are remembered for the problem that you solve. Let's be problem solvers. Can you give clarification on the double up session tonight? Okay, so do you mean oh in terms of the time? All right, let's go back to that real quickly. Yeah, it's just a it's just a typo on the flyer. It actually is eight central, nine eastern. Eight mm -hmm. central, nine eastern for tonight. Beautiful. Was that helpful? Any other quick questions, real fast? Wonderful. All righty, y'all. Have yourself yes. a yes. yes um, Yes, Chairman Angela. I want to know is this is on, okay? So this is actually only for active um, mm -hmm. members, and we can't invite visitors or this is prospects. not for visitors tonight. Okay, for okay. Those, 
Well, what we can do, we could sign up them visitors before eight o'clock, before nine o'clock. <laughs> That's <Okay>. right. <laughs> That's true. Yeah. You're right yeah. about that. Sign up, guys, because I'm telling you, people are looking for the bag right now. This is first yeah. quarter. They want the bag. So let's go ahead and please don't make it difficult for people to sign up. If they are telling you they're ready to go and they start asking how much, guys, stop talking. Stop talking. Get your pen and your paper. Get ready so you can start signing them up. Make it easy for them. Let's go ahead and get them signed up. You don't have to say a whole lot. This, 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 this academy sells itself. That's what I love about it. Less is better. Less is better. Share a couple lines and then, hey, are you ready to move forward? Ask them. All right, I could go ahead and help you get signed up right now. All righty. All we need is five minutes. Don't give them more than five minutes. And then you walk them through the link. Don't just send them. I don't just send them the link. No, I keep them on the phone with me and we work on the link together. Let's get it faster. You got to be able to come up with ways. You know, so many people right now, they need somebody to help lead them. Not everybody wants to think. So we're thinking for them. You need this because you know the benefit of it. They don't know, but they'll come back later and they'll say, Angela, thank you. Right? They'll say, Rashonda, thank you. They'll say, Pastor Tony, Thank you. They'll say, Kimberly, thank you. And then some will even say, well, why did you tell me about this earlier? Why did you push me? So guys, this is what we're doing. We're helping them today. So let's get them reactivated as soon as possible. Let's get them on this on the call tonight. Let's get them to trade together as a team. And guys, when they start making money, they'll never leave. To God be the glory. You guys be blessed. Love you dearly. Have a great one. God bless you. Bye-bye. Dr. K, I got a new account just for tonight. Let's go. Let's go. Let's fill it up. <laughs> Dr. K, I have one quick question. For Dr. K, okay. Yes. I just wanted to know for some people, what all do you need set up for tonight? Do you need HFX, uh, Hugo's way, whatever? That way, when they come in, they'll already be set up. Dr. K, still on with us? Auntie, you want to take that? Yeah, I can. Pastor Tony, I mean, basically, they just need their account set up. You know, um, now it's up to them if they want to trade live with us or they can trade in their demo. You know, that's their option. That's their option. And, you know, as a leader, that's what we do. We just instruct them. So whatever, um, we don't you know, recommend a particular broker. You know, we can't do that, Pastor Tony. So whatever broker they're comfortable with, just have them be prepared. You know, have their MetaTrader 4 in order or have their, um, um, the whatever broker that they want to use for HFX. I don't know how much HFX we're going to be doing tonight because I know Dr. Ben most likely will not be present tonight because it's his birthday. But tomorrow, yes. And we just go just as they normally would trade with their go live educators. No different, Pastor Tony. No different tonight. Does that help? Thank you. You're welcome. Wonderful, wonderful. Awesome, Pastor Tony. Thank you, Auntie. Again, as a reminder, don't forget to sign up for Go Chairman Little Rock. And the date is uh, January the 22nd. Go to go, go yes. chairman dot event. Go chairman dot event. All right, have a blessed day. Go change lives. They're waiting on you. Remember, you're remembered for the problem you solve. We're solving problems here at IM Academy. Love you. God bless. Bye bye. Great call, Dr. Angela. You take your phones off of mute as you say goodbye. Bye. Most excellent. Bye bye. 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 Bye bye.